Mpenzi mtazamaji kama ndio kwanza nafungua channel yako ya Tech TV tafadhali subscribe ili uwe mwanzo kupata video zetu mbali mbali za ndani na nje ya nchi. Share video hii bila kusahau kudondosha komenti yako kwani ni muhimu sana. First the analysis of public views canvassed in preparation of the draft Tanzania Vision 2050 indicated that the youth who are the majority of our population almost over 70% they called for smart exploitation and strategic use of the country's rich natural resources but also harnessing modern technologies such as artificial intelligence and data analytics for enhanced market efficiency, application of fintech and smart agriculture, as well as increased investments in integrated transportation systems, adoption and application of science, technology and innovation, as well as research and development and these should be the core of Tanzania's strategy to leapfrog to upper middle income country status. Now, since the theme of the 2024 CEO Roundtable Gala Dinner wants us to reflect on the Tanzania Vision 2050, I urge you in subsequent discourse to focus on practical ways to accelerate technology transfer, including green technologies, infusion and innovation, use of partnerships, support to R&D, and formation of technology incubation centers. Second, I urge the CEO Roundtable to deepen its commitment to drive innovative solutions and partnerships that enable businesses to align with our climate goals and tap into the potentials that it brings. And in this regard, there is a clear need for elevated collaboration between the private sector and the government to create practical pathways to a green transition that supports sustainable development and aligns with Tanzania's national priorities. I'm impressed by the presence of young CEOs in our midst tonight. I think this is an important gesture for sustainability and building of a critical mass of CEOs, although the number is still small. And therefore, I continue to beseech the CEO Roundtable to review the entrance requirements to make them accommodative so as to expand the outreach and bring on board CEOs from business startups and youth-dominated sectors such as creative and entertainment industries, ICT, as well as sports. Additionally, I would like to request for your support in tackling challenges of youth unemployment. While the government undertakes to revisit the education curricula with emphasis on imparting market-driven work skills, the CEO Roundtable has the role of expanding your businesses to create more jobs providing internship programs and startup capital, especially to graduates, and carrying out on-job and apprenticeship training. Fourth, you are all aware of the government's resolve and efforts to improve the business environment in order to foster a dynamic and competitive private sector. And these include policy and regulatory reforms, as well as clipping bureaucracy and corruption. The six-phase government has also made a mark in strengthening international partnerships and economic diplomacy, so as to better position the country 
as a key player in regional and global markets, as well as acting as an, a magnet to foreign direct investments. All in all, the current administration of President Samir cherishes the pivotal role of the CEO Roundtable, the private sector as a whole, and international partners in hastening socioeconomic transformation. I therefore call for scaling up of collaboration and innovative partnerships between the public and private sectors in order to bolster Tanzania's transformation. Fifth, in January next year, 2025, Tanzania is expected to host the Heads of State Summit on Mission 300 under the auspices of the World Bank and the African Development Bank, which has been dubbed as Africa's Energy Marshall Plan. It has an ambitious goal of providing ex access to electricity to 300 million Africans. While efforts are being made to ensure the summit's success, I encourage you to establish your niche in this forthcoming event and also strategize on how best to make and conclude business deals, networking, and tapping the experiences of multinational companies that will be attending. Tiff TV na kupatia video mbali mbali kutoka ndani na nje ya nchi. Tafadhali endelea kutufuatilia kupitia channel yetu ya Tiff TV, YouTube, Facebook, Twitter na Instagram. Bila kusahau kudondosha komenti yako kwani ni muhimu sana. Tiff TV tupo kijamii zaidi.